All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn intermediate CSS by building a cat painting. Step eight. All right. So to see the cat head element, we're going to give it a linear gradient background with this color at 85%. So it's going to go from this color to 85%. And then it'll start at this color from 85% all the way to 100%. All right. So we might not notice the difference between these two colors, but they are there. Oh, we'll notice them. All right. So if you forgot, like I did before I went, before I rehearsed this, uh, we can just come over here and say CSS linear gradient like that. And right here, we've got the Mozilla site. Mm, it's not the best. Let's go. Let's check out the W3 school. Uh, OK, so cool. Cool. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to have linear gradient as the background. And then we're going to have. What? <laughs> anyway, that's not good either. Uh, let's go to this one. Uh, and then we're going to have something like this. We're going to have the color. That's not that's not a good one either. That's not a good one either. Come on. Why don't they have a great one? Anyway, so basically we're going to have the color and then the uh, percentage and then a comma and then the color and then the percentage again. These are all horrible examples. They're not horrible, but they're not like what we're going to do. But what we're going to do here is we'll come down here and say background and we'll say linear hyphen gradient. And inside of here, because we're, it's like a function call, we're going to say uh, first the uh, hashtag 5E5E5E five e five e five e, like that. It's going to be that gray color and it's going to be till 85% like that. And then we'll have a comma and we'll say hashtag 4545 4F and we're going to send that until it's uh, at 100% like this. And so now we've got uh, what this gray color, this gray all the way down to this gray. So 85% is about right here where this is going to stop being this gray. And then it'll transition into this gray right here until 100%. Right. So that's basically what that's saying. So let's check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step nine. And we'll see you next time.